Good morning, grade four. Let's start our lesson. Today we have spelling lesson. Words with double consonants. Words with double consonants. Let's start with the double consonant D. When do we double the consonant, the, the uh, letter D, consonant D? We double consonant D when we have one syllable word ending with double consonant D. When we one syllable word ending with double consonant D, like here, add one consonant with double D we have. Odd. This is what, this is also one syllable word ending with double consonant D. Also, when we have vowel consonant, consonant vowel, when we have two syllables, when we have two syllables, the first syllable is vowel consonant, and the second syllable is consonant vowel, vowel consonant, consonant vowel. Let's check some words. Teddy, Ted, D. We have two consonants here. Ted, here we have vowel consonant, and in the second syllable, we have what? Consonant vowel. Like also, let's take daddy. Dad, D. We have two syllables here. The first syllable is vowel a then consonant d then the second syllable is consonant d and vowel y so this is two cases when we double the, the consonant d let's have more examples from our book Shatter, shatter, repeat please the word with me, shatter, shatter. Shatter, what do I mean by shatter? Shatter to shake because of fear or cold, when you are shaking because of, she, uh, because of fear or cold. Walking into a cold ocean makes me shatter. Shatter, it means to shake. Now check the double D, the double consonant here. We have vowel and vowel. We have two consonant, uh, two syllables. Shadder, shadder. The first syllable we have vowel, then consonant. And the second syllable we have uh, consonant, then vowel. Okay, now second word. Ridden. Repeat please the word. Ridden. Ridden. Ridden is the past participle of ride. Ride in the present, in the past, ridden. She had ridden a camel across the desert. Now let's Look at the double D here. What do we have? Red, den. Red, den. We have two syllables. The first syllable we have vowel, consonant, and the second syllable, consonant, vowel. Next word is odd. Odd. Odd, it means strange or unusual. Strange or unusual. Jen made an odd comment about his friend. Jen made an odd comment about his friend. A weird comment about his friend. Odd here, girls, is one syllable word what with with double double D. This is the first case that we talked about. Saddle. Saddle. Please repeat the new word. Saddle. Saddle. What do I mean by saddle? This is the saddle girl. Check, saddle. A leather covered seat that is put on the back of a horse. 
again, another covered seat that is put on the back of a horse, saddle. Put the saddle on the horse first. Let's check, why do we have double D here? Because we have two syllables, sad, dull. First of all, we have two syllables, and those two syllables, the first syllable is vowel consonant, and the second one is consonant vowel, okay? A, vowel, D, consonant, the first one, then consonant, and then, no, we have L-E, sorry. We have L-E. I'm sorry, so the third case I didn't give you when we have L-E, consonant L-E. Next one, when we have double consonant F. When do we use double consonant F? We use double consonant F when we have one syllable word ending with double F. Same like the D, one syllable word ends with what? With D. This is one syllable word ending with double consonant F. Like here. Off, one syllable. Cough, one syllable, ends with double F. Cliff, one syllable. I'm moving my mouth one time, one syllable. Cliff. Now, the second situation, when do we use double F? When we have two syllables, vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. Same as also as what? Also like. The D. Effect. We have here two syllables. The first syllable, vowel, consonant, and the second syllable, consonant, vowel. Office. Office. The first syllable is vowel, consonant, and the second syllable is what? Consonant, vowel. The last condition, when do we use double F? When we have double consonant followed by LE. Look, when we have double consonant followed by LE. Let's have more examples from the book. Different. Different. Not of the same kind. Different. Not of the same Kind. I'd like to try a different kind of shampoo. I'd like to try a different kind of shampoo. So, girls, different here. Why did we double the F? Because we have two syllables here. We have two syllables. The first syllable is vowel, consonant, and the second syllable is consonant vowel. Offer. Of first. What do I mean by offer? To give someone the opportunity to accept or take something. To offer, to offer someone, to give someone the opportunity to accept or take something. I will offer to take Jack to school. I will offer to take Jack to school. This is offer. Let's see, why did we double the F here? Because we have two consonants, uh, sorry, two syllables, two syllables. The first syllable of, we have vowel, consonant, and the second syllable is consonant, vowel. Next one, suffer, suffer, repeat please, suffer. What do I mean by suffer? Suffer, experience pain to experience pain, illness, or injury. To experience pain, illness, or injury. Suffer. Anna will suffer if she gets these things. Anna will suffer if she gets these things. Now, why did we double the F here, the consonant? Because we have two syllables, suffer. Two syllables. Vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. Vowel, U, consonant, F. And the second syllable, consonant, F. Then the E is the 
vowel. This is why we are we, we have here double F. Now let's move to double double S, double consonant S. When do we double the consonant S? When we have one syllable word ending with double consonant, one syllable, same as what? Same as the F and same as the D. One syllable words ending with S, we will double the S, like boss. One syllable here. Grass, kiss, glass, one syllable words. Now, the second situation, when do we double the consonant S? When we have vowel consonant, consonant vowel. Again, when we have two syllables with what? Vowel consonant, the first syllable, and the second syllable, consonant vowel, also the same. Now, let's see some examples. Scissors. Scissors. Here we have first syllable, vowel. Consonant and the second syllable, consonant, then vowel. Let's have some examples from our book. Grasshopper, grasshopper. Repeat, please, the word please. Grasshopper. Grasshopper is a plant eating insect. It's a plant eating insect that has a long leg used for jumping. A, glass, a, a plant eating insect that has a long legs used for jumping. The grasshopper ate the insect in the grass. The grasshopper ate the insect in the grass. Now let's see, why did we double the S here? Because we have girl, as I told you, grass. Grass here is one word and ends with what double S here because we have here uh, again it, it's one syllable grass one syllable grass and with double S. I know we have here also double T. We will study it now. Let's move on to the second word to the next. Situation, double consonant T, double consonant T. When do we double letter T? When we have one syllable word ending with double consonant T. Like what? Like mid. It's what? One syllable word end with double T. Now, also, when we have vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel, when we have vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel, two syllables with first syllable, vowel, then consonant, and the second syllable, but consonant and vowel, like mitten, mitten. We have here vowel, consonant, the second syllable, consonant, vowel. Matter, matter, so the word is matter. What do I mean by matter? Something that is being done, something that is being done or talked about or thought about. So something that's being done, talked about or thought about. Or material of a particular kind, material of a particular kind. What is the matter with your friends? What's going on with them? What is the matter of, with your friends? What's going on with them? Okay. Now, why did we double the T here? Because we have two syllables, matter. We have two syllables. The first syllable is vowel, then consonant. And the second syllable is consonant, then vowel. Next word is written. Written. Written is the past participle of write. Past participle of write. Uh, stop writing on the screen, please. Okay. The book was written a long time ago. 
the book was written a long time ago. A long time ago. Uh, why did we double the T here? Same situation, we have two syllables. The first syllable, we have consonant vowel, and the second syllable, we have what? Consonant, sorry, uh, again, the first syllable is vowel consonant, and the second syllable is consonant vowel. Lettuce, lettuce, lettuce. So, lettuce here, what is lettuce? A plant that has large leaves that are eaten, especially in salad. Lots of people like to eat lettuce salad. Why did we double the T here? Because we have two syllables. The first syllable is vowel, consonant, then consonant, vowel. Bottle, bottle, bottle. Bottle, a glass or a plastic container that has a narrow neck and usually has no handle. Store what's left in a glass bottle. Store what's left in a glass bottle. Why did we double the T here? Because we have the fur, because we have girls after the T L E. This is why we double the T. Now let's talk about double consonant. R, same like the previous one. When we have two syllables, vowel, consonant, the first syllable, and the second syllable, consonant, vowel. Same thing, I'm repeating the same thing, by the way. Uh, like carrot, carrot, carrot. Two syllables, the first syllable is vowel, consonant, and the second syllable is consonant, vowel. Tomorrow, tomorrow, we have here double consonant R. Why? Because we have vowel consonant, consonant vowel. Tomorrow, the meaning of tomorrow, the day after today, it's late, so I will finish tomorrow. It's late, so I will finish tomorrow. Next one, borrow. Borrow, to take and use something that belongs to someone else for a period of time before returning it back. So to take something, use it, and return it back again. This is borrow. Now, if you need more, you can borrow some from me. If you need more, you can borrow some from me. Why did we double the R here? Because we have two syllables. The first syllable is vowel consonant, and the second syllable is what? Consonant, vowel. Current, current, again, current, repeat, current, current, happening, or existing now, something is happening now. So this is the meaning of current, happening now happening now or existing now. Learn, read, must, current issue of the magazine, something that's happening now. She's reading about recent news. So, learn, read, the most current issue of the magazine. Uh, why did we double the R here? Same situation, because we have two syllables, current, vowel, consonant, first syllable, second syllable, uh, sorry, first syllable, vowel, consonant, yes. And the second uh, syllable, vowel, consonant. Consonant, vowel, sorry. Uh, let's move to the next word. Now let's talk about the double B. When do we double the B? When we have girls, vowel, Consonant at the first syllable when we have a short vowel. When do we have a short vowel class? When we have syllable ends with vowel consonant. When we have syllable ends with vowel 
consonant like here, rabbit. Rab, here we have vowel, consonant. And the A here is short because it comes after the consonant. This is why we call it short vowel. Rabbit, rabbit. So we will double the B. Rabbit, as you know, a small animal that usually lives in holes. The rabbit jumped through the grass. The rabbit jumped through the grass. Next word is worried. Worried. To feel or show fear and concern because you think that something bad has happened or could happen. Mom will worry if we get home late. Mom will worry if we, if we get home late. Again, why did we double the R here, girls? This is for the double R because we have vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. Now, slippers, slippers. Same situation, slippers, slippers. Why did we double the P here? Because we have the first syllable, vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. Clear? What is slippers? A light, soft shoe that is easily put on and taken off and that is worn indoor. Her new slippers kept her feet warm. Next one. Bubble. Bubble, bubble, bubble here, girls. We double the B because we have L E, L E at the, at the end. What do I mean by bubble? A tiny round ball of air or gas inside a liquid. You can blow a bubble under water. Now, hobby, hobby. Activity that a person does for pleasure when not working. Pleasure to have fun. Activity that a person does for pleasure when not working. Hobby. Sara's hobby is making stuffed animals. So why do we have double B here? Because we have vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. So, don't forget, we double. R, the P, the S, the D, uh, what else? The F, did I mention F? The R, when we have one syllable ends with F or with C or with D. The second situation, when we have two syllables, first syllable, vowel, consonant, second syllable, consonant, vowel. Also, when we have L E, when we have L E, don't forget that. Now, I need you to open your books, page 331. 